So I live in the heart of Bangalore and ever since I've been living uh, back here and my workplace and everything is close close to the basically the urban setting here uh, my breathing issues have just gotten worse and there is a correlation because before that I didn't have any of these problems um, and as I spend more time walking walking up and down the roads um, it just gets worse and worse and worse. I have been feeling very anxious about it because I don't know the steps to take in order to stop this from happening. I've had poor mental health um, for a while now. And speaking of the lived experience of that, which is as I'm walking down the road and as I'm living my day-to-day -day life, there are, uh, I mean, it's just overwhelming the kind of kinds of thoughts and um, responses and reactions that I that I have to everything I experience. Because um, clearly there is scientific evidence and I am, um, you know, I finished my undergrad, so I do understand what's happening around me. And the fact that I am I feel helpless because I don't know what to do about this. Essentially, if there's a problem, you try to solve it in some form, right? But here's something that, that is so overwhelming, so large, so daunting, that I'm just um, sort of sinking in my head and I guess... It's had a negative impact on my mental health. It, it haunts me, to be honest. If I if I could be completely honest, it haunts me the future. Um, that's because every morning when I open the newspapers, um, I see hundreds of cases. I mean, because I'm a human-centered designer and I see the world as a system and, and, and a networked um, um, system, an ecosystem and not... Um, I don't see problems in, in isolation, right? I see the whole picture. So in some form, when I'm reading the newspaper, or watching the news, climate change is an underlying theme in almost everything, be it the financial system, the healthcare, any sector, any human, human um, issue that's being talked about, there's an undercurrent of climate crisis, um, climate change, climate panic, that um, that that is born out of these conversations. That too in the media. Media is something that is very selective, um, carefully picks out narratives. So even in a space like the media, the climate crisis, climate panic does find its way. I personally have thought about it in the sense that how am I with my given platform, with my privilege so far, um, how am I going to escape this? this?